Uh, PAMO is Pan-African Mathematics Olympiad. It is an annual math competition for the best high school students who are less than 20 years. Uh, they are, they are, it is organized for them to compete and show their talent in mathematics. And the good thing is that this year it is happening in Rwanda. We are hosting it. Yes. I'm really ready for this competition, PAMO Tokyo 23, because actually it is not the first time being in this competition, last year I was in Team Rwanda. So now I'm really ready because if it is not the first time, I, I actually do many programs and trainings. So for this 2K23, I'm really ready. Yeah, actually, it's not my first time to participate in PAMO because uh, I participated in PAMO 2021. I participated in IMO 2022. So I got, I got uh, to I got the, the experience to, uh, about Olympiad mathematics. So I can say I'm really uh, excited and I'm really confident that this PAMO uh, Rwanda will, did, will do the best because of the experience we got from the past years. How they are. They are preparing us for this PAMO 2K23. We are doing some, some program like number theory, algebra, geometry, and combinatorics. This Olympiad mathematics focuses much on uh, problem solving because uh, <clears throat> in other competitions we are of mathematics, you are, you are mostly using formulas. Rather, in these competitions, we are like proving why we are using these formulas. It's all about problem solving using, using mind instead of like applying formulas to solve a problem directly. This competition is different from other competition because this competition, it focuses on problem solving. It is actually done through using your mind, not using formulas, because other competition, they actually use formulas only and then they are done. But in this competition, they don't use formulas. They use their mind in order to, to, find, to find out the solution without using those formulas from other competitions. Uh, we have a lot of uh, coaches. Uh, for example, every Wednesday, uh, I have an online course where I get to interact with my coaches. I, I give them uh, the answers for some problems. They give me the feedbacks, which, which help me to, to gain more experience about solving these problems. I also attend camps like this one, where uh, we also solve other problems. We learn new theories. We also read some, some books. We also do some personal trainings where you solve problems and you use some online uh, resources to gain more uh, experience. Um, the first thing I'd say is like uh, the world gets to know that there are talents in Rwanda, there are mathematicians in Rwanda and by that it means like we are attracting opportunities to the Rwandan students. Like for example I can say like uh, one of the students from these programs, uh, some of the students from these programs have been accepted into the top universities like MIT, Yale, Cambridge and also others like CMU. Uh, being selected uh, in MIT it was something I was not expecting, even though I was having uh, some kind, uh, I was having uh, achievements. Uh, it's not something I was expecting because it's very competitive and I'm really excited to join it. Uh, it's really a best university, whether you work in uh, extracurriculars, academics, everywhere, it's the best university. So I look forward to studying the engineering to be an exciting opportunity for me. I think generally the, how we are helping Team Randa is from the experience of we also had as being the students as they are and also the other thing we do for them is like we, all, we collect different problems and different resources from online and also unify them into one single, uh, one single resources that they can access easily here at math camps and also the other thing I think we provide, we provide them is like in-person feedback where we interact with the student one-on-one one -on -one to give them feedback on where they are stuck or maybe the problem they are facing so that they can improve themselves. Uh, another thing I think we help the students is like we prepare the mock exams where the students familiarize themselves with the exam settings so that when they get to sit for the real paper they won't be stressed by the pressure, maybe the time limit and also the uh, all the visitors and also the other participants they are working with.